The D-backs going for their third straight win, taking on the Cubs at Wrigley. Clay Buckholz coming off the DL on the hill for Arizona as he looks to shut down the highest scoring offense in the NL for the second straight game. Pick up the action in the second. It's Buckholz looking good facing Kyle Schwarber. Whoa, that's a strike. There goes Hap. Swing and a miss. He got him. Swing and a miss. Swing and a miss. Strikeout number four for Buckholz. The infield is in for the Cubs in this scoreless game. The batter will be Paul Goldschmidt. Goldie swings, and that's a base hit to right field. Hit it right by Baez, who is playing in. RBI single Goldschmidt. Jay scores one of the Diamondbacks. Now Sousa bats with two outs and the runner in scoring position. And Sousa shot base hit center field. Goldie will score. Almora cuts it off. Sousa's going to try for second. Here comes a throw, and he's going to be out at second base. Save at second base. And he's in scoring position now for Lamb. So look back at Sousa, who's running to third. And a base hit left field by Lamb to get a run home. And the Diamondbacks lead it 3 to nothing. And now Archie Bradley inherits a bases loaded two-out jam. He will face Albert Almora, Jr. Swing and a miss. Archie Bradley puts out the fire and leaves him loaded. So the base is loaded here for Cattell Marte. Here's a stretch by the right-hander in the first pitch. And a ground ball back up the middle. Russell makes a diving stop and hasn't got a play. A run will score to make it 5-1. to one. The D-backs win their third straight, taking out the Cubs 5-1. Arizona pitching has held the highest scoring offense in the NL to two runs in 18 innings over the first two games of the series. Clay Buckholz, the victory, allowing just a run in six and two-thirds innings. Steven Souza Jr. finishes with three hits.